place the play cursor and press T to split the object. That original 8 bar audio object has now been divided into four shorter objects of two bars in length. Each object has now been assigned its own dedicated object editor. I'm going to rename those objects. I'm using the double arrows to navigate between them. Selecting an object updates the editor so it becomes active for that object. As I switch between objects, the object name is shown on the object editor title bar. Click the play stop button to play from the current cursor position. You can of course use the spacebar to play and stop. Play Solo will play only selected objects. Turning on loop mode and pressing Play Solo will cycle that selected object. Pressing Ctrl plus Spacebar will enable the Play Solo status as well. Notice also that during playback the PL button turns blue. This indicates that playback of that object is in progress. <laughs> 